So at PSI, we work with a layered um, quantum material, but we can switch this material from an insulating off state to a metallic on state by applying a, a firm pulse. It can be switched on ultra fast time scale and very energy efficient compared to standard electronics. I prepare these samples by starting with a bulk crystal and then I use regular scotch tape which I stick onto the crystal. I remove a few layers from the material and I repeat this process until I have a thin couple of hundred nanometer thick flake uh, that I can then deposit on a standard silicon wafer and pattern electrodes on top. So to study what happens inside the material, we use big machines like the Swiss light source here, which essentially are a microscope that allow us to look inside the material, see what's going on. At a micro SAS streamline, we study the switching by looking how the electrons order. We call this charge order. And charge order is different if it's on switch and when it's switched. And so by using a micron sized beam, we can raster the device and that allows us to identify exactly which portions of the device have switched already, which haven't. What we did observe is that the device, which is in a particular form, namely only a small portion switches, and importantly, that not only the electrons change, but also the lattice. And that has implications on how we use these devices. So the present study we carried out much before switching and after switching here at the SLS. But in the future, we want to use other sources like Swissfell, where we can really observe the, the switching process and make a video of it as it happens.